Some people ask, how is it possible to become a, 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 a volunteer with Waycross? Well, one of the ways you do is you go stand around the truck and you right. wait until somebody says, here, carry this. Here, bring yeah, it, you're it. Bring this microphone that works into the, <laughs> into the arena. Okay. Well, now that the, the funnies are out of the way up here, Sean Memick is 33 and 2 from St. Ed's. And uh, certainly uh, he's, uh, he's uh, well known. Uh, Memick is another one of those uh, St. Ed's guys. He was first at 145, first at 135, oh, and second at 130. And gets the takedown. And is, he, is he giving him the takedown Wait a minute. Did he not? give the takedown? Both up. No. no okay, that's up. a good call. How about that? 0-0. Zero, zero, no points. Derek Four was runner-up last year, as Greg pointed out, and was runner-up at 135 the year before that. He's 45 and 1 now. And obviously would like to even up the score a little bit. He's in on that. Both seniors. That makes a two-time mistake, sir. Yep. Four is a two-time runner-up. Oh, take now. Sean Memick, Lakewood St. Ed. We just had some fun here uh, during that uh, most recent break. A former wrestler of mine, uh, Rick Kircher, stopped by with Newspaper articles from 1973, and boy, did we have fun looking at some guys from back then. Yeah, I, was, I think I was just going into school at that time. You were what? <laughs> you don't, don't try to kid people. <laughs> they know that you're older in dirt. Actually, yeah, I think I was graduating college back then. But you should have seen pictures of Dave. Oh, Folks, uh, that was a, that was back a, in his wrestling weight when he used to work out with the the middleweights of the Finneytown team before he graduated to working out with the upper weights. No, no, you don't work you don't work up. I always worked down, down yeah. <laughs> regardless of what my body was. Yeah, it's when the three pounders were whooping on me. That's when you decide to retire. All right. Nothing, Sean not, do nothing. Two, okay. two zero at the end of the first. Sean Memick of St. Ed's in the lead. Kind of an interesting weight class. Sean Memick, a two-time returning state champion in Division Three, or Division One, excuse me. Division Two. Um, we had Colt Sponseller, who's a two-time returning state champion, 48 no. So uh, we've got basically four. Four state champions on two match uh, titles right there. And it could be a total of six. Well, will be a total of six between two guys, I think. He's trying to tip him. He's got it this He's time. getting points. Four. And two points. Four to nothing. And it's probably going to be four one here shortly. Should be four one. You're pretty good. Cool. Yeah, cool. okay, four. Gets his one, 4 1. Sean Mimic of St. Ed. Derek Four advanced to the finals with a 46 second pin in his first match against uh, Westerville Central. Uh, a 7 6 win in the quarterfinals and a 10 8 win. Uh, against uh, Mason Shalash of Reynoldsburg in the semifinals. Uh, Mimic had a pin in his first match and a 17-2 technical fall in the quarterfinals and a pin in 351. Well, Mimic seems to be on a roll here, I would say. Four to one minute, three seconds left. Got a great, good match going on in that too. Eleven to seven, state champions, uh, defending two-time state champion, is winning, but uh, getting all he can handle. And make up four-one.
Brent Hullock, in the uh, front headlock. 40 seconds, not much going on there. As we get up to this, these weights here, we get uh, between, you know, uh, 35 to 52, I think, you know, we have the quick uh, athletic uh, wrestlers. We get past 60 here, or 71, we start getting a little bigger, guys, a little slower, a little more strength. The moves change a little bit. We get a little more power. Not quite as much uh, continuous action. It kind of ebbs and flows a little bit. These guys are powerful. They, especially at these weights, uh, you get that much weight put on you. Um, and the higher we go, the, the risk-reward levels change. Four one. The end of two, going into the third. Four one. Sean Mimic. <laughs> Cleveland St. Ed's. They just keep sending more down every every year. You get. They just send in a new fresh supply of horses. I think this year breaks the record of what, 11 in a row. Now they old, their old record of 10 in a row back in the 70s and 80s. With Maple. No, that Edwards had like at this. Oh, yeah, right. So yeah. It'd be like 21 out of 25 or something like that. Yeah. They had a little hiatus there for a few years. Sean Mimic on the bottom. Uh, he leads. Derek Four looked at his uh, coaches, and uh, coach kind of shrugged and said, "Well, I don't know. You're going to have to figure it out." <laughs> Memick keeps crowding in, crowding in, crowding in. Four puts in the legs. Mm -hmm. Trying to force the half in. One minute away from a third state title. One minute to go. I think four is going to cut him loose. And he does four two. <laughs> well, four comes right back. Five, 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 three, five three now. now. Five to three. Now, what can they do with it? Now, the issue now is, yeah, can you get any back to that side? Uh, he's trying awful hard. He's going to kick him, I think. Yeah, it'd be hard for him to kick him twice, I think, for 35 seconds. But mm -hmm. kind of got him in. Figure it's too close under 20, but yeah. the 30, you got a chance. Yeah, yeah I think he is. The uh, question is whether uh, Lake is saying that's good working. Right? Yeah, is he stalling? The yeah, official finally calls oh, it. Oh, yeah. there. Now we're going to call it. They're a little slower here at the state finals. Stalemate, they call. That's interesting. Well, he's cutting him now, but it's too late. Yeah, if he, you know, he's 12 seconds now. That's no time. No time he's got to cut him and try a head and arm. Heck, going to run away from him. He didn't let him get out. Yeah. Wasted a lot of time right there. Now well, that's the match, 5-3. Yep. Good match. So two three-time state champions at the 152-pound weight or 160. 160. Excuse me. Derek Four he loses to Sean Memick. And Memick picks up his third state title. He graduates this year. I'm pretty sure there's a whole bunch of people that will be glad There have been a whole lot of returning state champions here. <laughs> Well, we're going to move on now to the uh, 